Welcome to Vatec Video Training that shows you how to take the optimum images using the latest product manufactured by Vatec. Now you are watching the state-of-the-art medical system. Our latest system and control units will take you to acquire the most accurate images. Now we start the standard patient positioning guide for cephalometric lateral image. First, please turn on the switch. If the machine is not working, although the switch is on, please check the emergency shutdown switch. Before image capturing, execute Easy Dent and register the patient information. Enter chart number, name, date of birth, gender, and address of the patient. Then click Add to complete patient registration. Then click the Pano icon on the Pano Ceph filed to run capture software. Go to Imaging Mode and click the Ceph. Select the Scanning Mode on the Ceph Examination. Now for the cephalometric lateral image. So please select the lateral. According to patient's gender and age, select man, woman, or child. Next, please do the appropriate setting for the patient's bone density type. Depending on the patient's bone density type, you can select hard, normal, or soft. Click the confirm button when the patient setting is completed. Then the equipment will set in positioning mode. To take the CEF images of the lateral mode, you have to locate the ear rod and nasal positional in proper position. Unfold the nasal positioner to down and turn the ear rod to locate the lateral position. Leave an enough space between the ear rods and move the nasal positioner out for patient's convenience. Fold the nasal positioner to up. Cover a cap over the ear rod for patient safety. Guide a patient to the unit. All jewelry and metallic objects such as necklaces, earrings, hairpins, eyeglasses, dentures, and orthodontic appliances should be removed before patient image capturing. Patient can keep their removed jewelry personally or place them on the guided shelf. Assist the patient to appropriately wear the lead apron. Be careful the lead apron is not above patient's neck. Ask the patient to stand next to the CEF unit. Using the up-down switch, adjust the height of the ear rod at patient's ear holes approximately. Guide the patient into the CEF unit and place patient's head between ear rods. Using the up-down switch, position the ear rod at the exact patient's ear holes level. Tighten the ear rods and insert them into the ear holes to hold and fix the patient's head and height. Adjust the patient's Frankfurt plane at a level with floor manually tilting patient's head. Unfold the nasal positioner down and set the nasal positioner at the root of nose between the eyes. Make sure operator keep holding the positioner in one hand and press the up-down button in another hand when operator adjusts height of the positioner. Ask the patient to stand straight up in a comfortable position to release the tension in shoulder and neck muscles. Ask patient to close eyes, keep mouth closed and not to move. Back to the control unit and click the ready button. Press and hold the exposure switch as the guide in capture software. While the exposure switch is held, radiation is exposed and proceeds taking the images. After the image acquisition, save the captured image. If the manual save is set, click the save button to save the image. Open the ear rod and the nasal positioner and fold the positioner to make enough space for patient going out. Ask the patient to open the eyes and guide patient out from the unit and unfold the positioner to down.
Check the captured image.